I will show you first how it works from the customer's point of view. Customer connects to PISO Wi-Fi. Click Insert Coin to enable the Vendo machine. Insert coins on the Vendo machine. Click Generate Code. After the code is generated, it will auto-log in the code. You can also disable auto login on the portal config. Now let's proceed with the setup process. We will configure our device first. Reset the device, then press the config button when the reconfig text appears on the LCD. This will boot into config mode and display the SSID and IP address of the device. Now let's connect to devices as SID. Open Chrome browser and enter the IP address of the device. Enter the Omada controller's IP, here I am using OC200 as the controller. Enter also the username and password of the controller with admin access. When using Insert Coin Portal, setting static IP address is a must. Please make sure that the IP address and network are correct and can be reachable. Review and check if the configurations are correct then click update. The device will now restart using that setting. Please wait while the device connects to the Omada controller and downloads the necessary information for the device. Now that's the device is already set up, let's proceed to editing the portal. Rotate your screen to see it more clearly. Download the portal zip file and extract Open Visual Code Studio or any editor of your choice. Carousel images are saved on the image directory, you can add yours or change the image. Sound effects are saved on the sounds directory, this can also be customized. Now let's open the config.js file for multiple Vendo. Every machine is attached to the SSID name of the hotspot. As you can see here I have three Vendo machine attached to each SSID. Multiple SSID can also be bind to a single Vendo machine. Please make sure that the IP address is correct. Prices can also be edited here. Let's now zip the file using WinRAR application. Just select all and add to archive and choose zip as a file format. This will be uploaded later on the Omada controller. Let's now configure the Omada controller. On your computer, connect to the Omada's IP, log in, and open the default site. I am using version 5.158. 12 as this is the stable version for the insert coin portal to work without issues. 
Go to Settings, then click ACL. Now go to EAP ACL. I already created a rule here so I just click edit, you can just create one. Add name, set policy to permit, on protocols add TCP. On source type choose SSID and choose the hotspot you use. Then create IP port group on the destination. Add the network subnet with 24 and the port 8728. The network IP depends on your setup. Now let's save the configuration. Go to settings then click portal then edit your portal. Now let's go to access control tab and add the IP address of our Vendo machine. I'm using slash 32 to isolate access only to the Vendo. Add the IP address and save the access control configuration. Now let's go back to the portal configuration and upload our newly edited insert coin portal zip file. Now that's done, we can test the insert coin capability of the Vendo. We can also use the Arklam Wi-Fi Vendo app for login this time and save the code. You can delete the saved Wi-Fi code by swiping right. By using the Arkham Wi-Fi app, generated codes are saved automatically. You can use this code for later use. If you want to use the last saved code, just swipe left and click Use Vouchers. This will automatically copy and enter the code onto the text box. That's it, your portal insert coin is now configured and ready. For orders just go to Instack. PH, Arklam Shop, thank you and don't forget to like and subscribe.